Plaques. What are they doing in my brain? Another day. Another Dr. Snow brain health story. Brain plaques are abnormal clusters of protein fragments called beta amyloid protein that accumulate between neurons or nerve cells in the brain. Amyloid plaques are a characteristic feature of Alzheimer's disease, a progressive neurodegenerative disorder, but also occur in normal brain aging starting as early as in your 20s. Amyloid plaques under the light microscope look like small Swedish meatball clumps between neurons. In a healthy brain, beta amyloid protein is produced and cleared away naturally. However, in Alzheimer's disease, there is an imbalance in the production and clearance of beta amyloid, leading to its accumulation and the formation of brain plaques. The exact cause of this imbalance is not fully understood, but it is believed to involve a combination of genetic, environmental, and lifestyle factors. The presence of amyloid plaques in the brain disrupts the normal functioning of nerve cells and contributes to memory loss and cognitive decline in several ways. Toxicity. Beta amyloid aggregates can form toxic clumps that interfere with the communication between neurons. This disrupts the normal transmission of electrical and chemical signals necessary for memory formation and retrieval. Inflammation. The accumulation of amyloid plaques triggers an immune response in the brain that can lead to chronic inflammation. This inflammation can cause further damage to nerve cells and contribute to cognitive impairment. Tau protein abnormalities. Amyloid plaques can also interact with another protein called tau protein, leading to the formation of twisted protein fibers known as neurofibrillary tangles. These tangles are another hallmark of Alzheimer's disease and contribute to the destruction of neurons further impairing memory and cognitive function. Tangles are found inside neurons and in recent years can now be seen in live patients with PET imaging. Synaptic dysfunction. Synapses, which are the connections between nerve cells are crucial for information processing and memory formation. The presence of amyloid plaques disrupts synaptic function impairing the ability of neurons to communicate effectively. It's important to note that brain amyloid plaques is only one of three main key components of Alzheimer's disease. Plaques, tangles and inflammation, known as PTI and phrased by Dr. Alan Snow, is the three components needed for severe memory loss and dementia as seen in most patients with Alzheimer's disease. Other factors such as heparin sulfate proteoglycans, first discovered over 30 years ago in Alzheimer's brains by Dr. Alan Snow of Dr. Snow Brain Health, also have recently been shown to play significant roles in the development and progression of Alzheimer's disease and its associated memory loss. Thanks for watching. And please subscribe to the Dr. Snow Brain Health channel. Watch for weekly brain health videos from world-renowned Alzheimer's disease, brain aging and memory loss expert Dr. Alan Snow who has researched this for over 30 years.